Yo, what's up guys? Quick Timing here and welcome back to a new GTA Online video. So today guys, I've got the new money glitch after patch 1.07. Now just before we get into this video and I'll show you guys how to do this money glitch. If you guys could drop a like rating, I'd greatly appreciate it. I don't normally ask for likes at the start of videos, but if you guys could do that, that would be greatly appreciated. And also, if you guys like my GTA 5 content, I've got a, a variety of GTA 5 videos on my channel and I've got loads of more to post. So feel free to subscribe if you're new to the channel as I'll be releasing lots more of GTA 5. By the way guys, I'm not actually the founder of this glitch as well. My friend Granty is, so shout out to him for actually finding this. You guys could probably go check him out, his link will be in the description. Alright guys, so let's get right into this glitch and I'll show you exactly how to do it. So first of all, one thing that I will say is that you do need a lot of money to even attempt to start doing this glitch. So be prepared to possibly lose a little bit of money at the start as this could go potentially a bit wrong. But once you get this going guys, you'll be making lots of money. I don't know how much money an hour, but every time you sell one of these cars, you get $600,000 and that's a lot of money if it stacks up after time. Alright guys, so how you do this basically is you need to have a full garage, an absolutely full garage, it doesn't matter of which car. But in that full garage guys, you have to have one purchased z-type car now if you don't have this this glitch is not going to essentially work and you're going to keep messing up doing this glitch if you want if you're rich enough you can have multiple of these it doesn't really matter the next step would be to go into a invite only session now what you want to do is invite your friend into that session or multiple friends it doesn't really matter you need to have a friend inside of your garage at all times doing this glitch if there's not someone inside your garage this glitch isn't going to work so you could take it in turns with somebody and rotate the process if you want to help them make some money as well so once you've got a friend inside of there, the reason why you need to have somebody in there is because if you actually get kicked out of a session during this, you need to have that friend to invite you back in. Now, I'd say around 70% of the time you don't get kicked out, but just for that 30% of the time that you could possibly get kicked out the same session, it's always good to have a friend in there just to back you up just in case you do get kicked out and you don't necessarily want to be wasting $900,000 just to get kicked out of a session to redo it all again. Alright guys, so after you've got a friend inside your session, what you want to do is go into your phone book, go to travel and transport. Now once you see motorsport, you want to go down to the Z type. Now once you go into that, you want to click purchase, but considering you've got a uh, full garage, you won't actually be able to purchase it straight away. So it's going to ask you a car that you want to replace. Now, this is the bit which comes into play, you need to listen very carefully to this bit. Alright guys, so... You guys will see a list of 10 cars which is asking you to replace so you want to click on the one that is right next to your z-type which you previously bought at the start of this glitch so in my case i believe it was the vaca or the vasa however you say that i'm not too sure but um yeah in my case i believe it was that so what i did was i clicked it once but then you guys you don't click it again to confirm it so you should then get the confirmation message and wait a couple of seconds so after you get the confirmation message you want to press start l1 and then xx if you're on the xbox you want to press start LB and then AA and then after you press AA you want to spam it so fast and if you're on the PlayStation you want to press X really really fast so what this will do is take you to the PlayStation store but at the exact same time you're actually replacing a vehicle without losing any money and what this will do is glitch the car out and you have a car spawn on top of another car and then that glitch car is a car you can sell into Los Angeles Customs and you paid absolutely nothing for that so basically the next step is to back out the PlayStation store and then you should load back into your session. Now once again guys, even if you don't load back into your session, you've got that friend in that session with you in your garage who can always invite you back. So in my case, I believe I had a friend had to invite me back. I can't remember when I did this, but uh, a couple of times when I was doing it, I did have to have people invite me back for me to do this glitch properly. So once I go back into my garage, as you guys can see, my Z-Type is stacked on top of another Z-Type. Now, what you guys want to do is go into the top Z-type, not the bottom one. If you guys go into the bottom one, I don't believe it works at all and you have to retry the whole thing. So once you go inside the top of one, you want to drive out the garage, drive it down to Los Angeles Customs, tune it up a little bit if you want to, it doesn't really matter, and then just sell it and make some really good money if you ask me. So once you've done that, guys, you want to go back to your garage and repeat the process, and it's pretty much just like that. Now, if you guys do mess this up somehow and you've got multiple of the other cars and not the Z-type, you can always start a new session but just make sure you guys have got 10 cars, otherwise that $950,000 is going to come right out of your pocket and you're going to be losing lots of money doing this glitch. So just make sure you've got 10 cars inside of your garage before you reattempt to do this. But guys, that's basically it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully it does help you out. Please drop a like rating if you haven't already. Would appreciate it, guys. And please subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. I'll be releasing lots more of GT5 glitches, tips and tricks. Alright guys, I will catch you in the next video. And as always, have a nice day. My name's been Quick Timing, and peace out.